Alright guys, what's up? In this tutorial, I'll be teaching you how to download and install Phoenix 3. Alright, we'll start off by downloading a SVN program. Um, I use Talks SVN. It's free, simple. So, alright, Google Talks SVN. Um, if I can spell it. <laughs> alright, go to their website. And you want to go to the download page. if it loads right then you want to scroll down to 32 bit or 64 bit you should know what your computer is, mine's 32 bit so I'll click that link <coughs> and then click the download now button um, run uh, run or save to run it don't really matter to be honest um, wait for it to download alright um, then you want to click run when it's downloaded and then this brings up the installer um, just follow it through follow the steps um, I'm not going to install it because I've already got it installed so I'll click cancel after you finish the installation it'll ask for a reboot um, you don't really need a reboot because you just don't need to do it <laughs> and, and then what you want to do is make a new folder on your desktop and call it phoenix3 phx3 and then right click on it click SVN checkout there's two new icons two, two new things you can select select SVN checkout and then to get this link here, um, I've uploaded it to my forums, um, logicalevolution.co.uk. Um, I recently started a community and these are the forums for it. Um, if you could help me by registering and making a few posts and that, I'd be really grateful. And then once you're on the site, you want to navigate to tutorials and downloads. And then Phoenix Free SVN. And this link here, you want to copy it and then you want to paste it into here and then OK it and then it should start downloading yep there you go, it's downloading uh, um, I'm going to cancel this because I've already downloaded it it should take around 15-20 um, minutes depending on your internet speed to download um, hit OK after it's downloaded um, and then you should see Phoenix 3 on your desktop and it should have some files in it um, now what you want to do is you want to go to your computer local disk drive C program files Steam Steam, Steam apps um, your account name Gary's Mod Gary's Mod again and then add-ons then you want to put the Phoenix 3 folder we just created on your desktop into your add-ons folder just drag and drop it simple as that and then wait for it to transfer restart the game and then you're done that's basically it um, yeah if you can subscribe, comment, um, rate um, it would really help me if you did register on our forums and make a few posts in that. Alright, thanks for watching.